Hi guys, welcome back to another quick tip video from Go Engineer. My name is Dane Potter. Today we're going to be going over the properties in the trim tool of the WeldMet function. As you see here, we have a couple of WeldMet structural members and they're intersecting. We want to trim them up. So the first thing we need to do is go to Trim Extend. Pick what items need to be trimmed. So I'm going to pick my first member. You can pick face or body. I'm going to start off with face. When you select the face, it trims to the face. It shears it off at that face. But when you select body, select the body, and it recognizes the entire body. So if you have a cope on the side, it's going to round that cope up around the rounded edges of the trimming body. You can see a preview or not see a preview. I'm going to cover the cope on my next trim. We can include a weld gap. As you see here, we have an included weld gap. Or we can turn the weld gap off, and as you see, it goes up to the trimming body. When you make this kind of trim, you can just tell it to just end the trim at that body. We can end the miter. So the body that's being trimmed and the trimming body are both mitered. So it takes the trimming body and cuts it back to the trimmed body. As you can see here, or we can do a butt trim in one direction or a butt trim in the other direction. But for now, we're just going to tell it to trim up to the body. Accept that. The next body that we're going to be trimming, I want to cover the cope. You see how you have this rounded edge? I want the trimmed body to cope around that round edge. What you do is you select the body to be trimmed, like in the previous example. Select body, not just the face, but the body, so it will recognize the whole body. Select the trimming body. Let's zoom up here a little bit so you can get a better look coped cut between bodies. I select that and it copes this cut around the trimming body. So what we have here is a coped body. Will you look at this and say well I don't want that piece sticking up there. Let's turn that off. I can edit this trim and add bodies to it. As you see, this piece disappeared. It's in the discard function. I can select it to keep it or discard it. You can toggle back and forth between those. So we have trimming bodies that you can cope. You can trim up to body. You can go to the face and just a few different functions with the trim tool in the WeldMet function. Thank you for watching this quick tip from Go Engineer. Mm -hmm.